The BMW iX isn't the German carmaker's first dedicated electric vehicle. That was the now discontinued i3 hatch. Nor is it their first electric SUV. That's the iX3. But it is BMW's new flagship EV, and it certainly looks ready to do battle with Mercedes-Benz EQC, the Audi e-tron, and Jaguar I-Pace. Let's see if it's got what it takes. The BMW iX lands in Australia in three variants, xDrive 40, xDrive 40 Sport and xDrive 50 Sport, with the 440kW M60 Performance flagship coming soon. The 5-set iX is a big, bold SUV boasting X5 proportions, but that's about where the similarities end. It undercuts its three most direct rivals with a starting price of $135,900 plus on-road costs and here we're testing the iX xDrive 40 Sport, priced at just under $142,000. The iX is striking and quite obviously not your average BMW SUV. The enormous full height covered in double kidney grille is home to an array of safety tech, cameras and sensors covered by a special polyurethane protective layer that reduces minor damage and over time will actually fix minor damage like stone chips, all by itself. Mind-blowing. The angular body, unique surface creases, flush fit door handles, frameless side windows and blackened slimline taillights all help to differentiate the iX exterior. The iX40 Sport graduates from 21 to 22 inch jet black alloys that look fierce. Just stick to the tarmac and watch the curbs. The BMW iX40 is powered by a 77 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery and two electric motors, one at the front and one at the rear. And it sends a decent 240 kilowatts of power and 630 newton meters of torque to all four wheels. It's got a claimed zero to 100 time of hot hatch like 6.1 seconds. That's not bad for a big heavy high riding family wagon. Fully charged, the iX xDrive 40 has a potential driving range of 425 kilometers. Step up to the xDrive 50 and those numbers increase to 630 kilometers, 112 kilowatt hours, 385 kilowatts and 765 newton meters. And the zero to 100 time drops to just 4.6 seconds. Power is delivered via a single reduction gear and selection duties are handled by a stubby looking shifter. A crystal one in this case. The interior represents an entirely new approach for BMW and I'm excited by that. Whether or not traditionalists will be remains to be seen. The minimalist cabin and paired back design makes this feel huge and it's a really clever use of space with this large screen, the absolute hero. And this eye candy is what's called the bold and clear interior application, which now I've seen, I don't think I could live without. A 14.9 inch digital instrumentation cluster blends with a 12.3 inch multimedia touchscreen to create one seriously large curved screen, which sets the new mood for BMW's iDrive system. Luxurious electric adjust leather heated and ventilated seats with two position memory are supremely comfortable. The panoramic sky lounge glass roof features an electrochromatic shade that protects occupants from UV and heat. It's standard on iX50 and an option for other variants. Storage is good with open spaces for phones, wireless charging, cup holders and a lidded armrest. This not only looks good, it works well too. There's a great deal of functionality on the screen and with size on its side, it's easy to navigate. The controls on the chunky steering wheel have been paired back, which forces the driver to either use this rotary dial, the screen or voice control. The new information technology detail is extensive and the presentation and functionality makes rival systems look dated. The digital instrumentation panel is huge. It looks quite futuristic and it has a variety of customizable information to display. You'll find safety eyes galore in the iX, five cameras, five radars and 12 ultrasonic sensors in total, providing multiple viewpoints with crystal clear clarity. They also deliver an extensive array of safety functions, including developments in smart tech like forward collision warning for intersection and turning maneuvers. 
The second row is every bit as spacious and comfortable as the front of cabin and this flat floor provides great space for all three occupants. And where family cars are concerned, I am always in favour of these hard backs which are really easy to wipe clean. You'll find two USB-C outlets in the back of seats, four all up, four directional air vents, climate control, indoor storage, an armrest with two cup holders and overhead lights. Three top tether anchor points and two neatly concealed ice fix positions are standard. An electric tailgate opens to a decent sized boot that has all the functionality and the gadgetry you'd expect from a luxury SUV. The boot is home to a 12 volt outlet, a light, bag hooks, four anchor points and a stretchy strap. Beneath the floor you'll find your charging cords and a handy cabin divider net, but no spare tyre. The split fold seats can be lowered via a button in the boot and there's another button by each outboard seat in the second row. But it's how BMW's latest EV drives is what I really want to talk about. Let's go. The high riding position and airy cabin give a very commanding sense of your surroundings and overall comfort levels are excellent. Put your foot down and the iX pounces. The always ready punch of EV power is brutal, but the powertrain is also very flexible, offering exceptional drivability. The iX40 boasts the dynamic character of smaller, sportier cars. It's sure-footed and nimble, and for an SUV of this size, it just has no business doing so. It does make me wonder if the incoming M60 powerhouse will just be overkill, whether that power will ever be needed or fully exploited, and nor should it be around the suburbs. An intelligent four-wheel drive system with torque vectoring and anti-wheel slip technology ensures precise distribution of exactly the right amount of traction at any given time. Clever adaptive braking reads the road to deliver appropriate levels of off-throttle braking while maximising regenerative energy. Choosing from low, medium or high to suit your style and make one pedal driving a cinch. Comfort and refinement levels are exceptional and with the family load in mind, the cosseting amenity extends to all occupants. The design and build quality in the cabin is absolutely flawless. Every touch point, every detail. Actually, there's one thing I don't love. It's this hexagonal steering wheel. It is the only one on offer, so maybe that love will grow. The iX xDrive 40 has a claimed driving range of up to 425 kilometers, which should be enough for most daily drivers. Likewise, its energy consumption and charging times are also competitive, while Clevertech shows you real-time data and tips to improve your driving efficiency. Forward and side vision is really good in the iX, but that small rear window really does hinder rearward vision. Although a multitude of cameras do help in that regard. The iX warranty and servicing provisions fall short of the pack, but the battery is good for eight years. A supremely quiet and comfortable cabin and immense immediate power output make the iX a joy to drive. It delivers the surprise and delight factor that is so often spoke about but rarely rings true. Zero emissions, maximum enjoyment. Add to this BMW's latest in-car safety and convenience technologies and the iX is a convincing new take on the family-friendly zero emissions luxury SUV. Clever, classy and spot on for family friendly values, the BMW iX ticks many, many boxes with zero emissions, the cherry on top. BMW's new flagship EV really is the electric SUV luxury car buyers have been waiting for.